modern civilization is a hungry beast. It demands mobility, speed and connectivity. A robust railway system is the lifeblood of a thriving civilization. Moving men and materials over vast distances, powering businesses, powering economies, powering a way of life. India is a large country geographically and in order to create a marketplace that is truly competitive, there is a need for fast, efficient and reliable transportation, particularly for freight. With the dedicated freight corridor project, also known as the DFC project, Indian Railways is laying down the track for India's progress into a brighter tomorrow. The DFC will connect the four golden quadrilateral cities of New Delhi, Mumbai, Chennai and Kolkata. In order to accomplish this audacious goal, the Indian Railways needed the right partners. For the western arm of the DFC project, this proved to be Aircon International. Aircon's USP is Okay, whichever project we undertake, we complete it. We do not leave the project in between. We have completed 125 projects in internationally in 25 countries and more than 400 projects successfully in India. IRCON is a turnkey construction company that covers the entire spectrum of construction activities and services in the infrastructure sector and specializes in working with challenging terrain. This project is a part of Western DFC from Sachin to Vetarna along Mumbai Delhi Rajani route passing through the states of Gujarat and Maharashtra. It has total route kilometers of 186 kilometers double line with 380 kilometers of track and has total cost of 2700 crores. The Vetarna to Sachin stretch is codenamed CTP12. It is a 186 km stretch through terrain that encompasses coastal regulation zones, mangroves, farmlands and hilly areas. There are various challenges in this project, like there was ballast quality was very poor, then there are various bridges which were to be completed. Work is going on war footing round the clock so that we complete the project in time. We are bound to complete this project by June 22. The weather in this part of the country makes work of this nature particularly difficult, especially during the extended monsoon season. Working next to the existing Indian railway track requires additional safeguards to protect not only the staff but the stability of the track itself. However, none of these challenges can compare with the challenge of working during the COVID pandemic. The pandemic stretched the team's resources and resourcefulness to the limit. But Irkorn's strength comes from a culture of innovation and their highly qualified, enthusiastic and experienced staff. Despite all the challenges, seen and unforeseen, the team is delivering the project on time and on budget. One of the biggest innovations that is making this feat possible is the introduction of the new track construction or NTC machine. The DFC project is the first time that NTCs are being deployed in India. We have imported NTC machines from USA. It is the first public sector undertaking in the country which is owning NTC machine. We can do 1.5 km track laying every day with the help of this machine which will be of very high standard so that trains can run having a load of 30 ton per axle. 
traditionally in India, we do manual track lay. Around 650 tons of material need to be handled for one kilometer of track. To handle this, we have to deploy at least 700 to 800 man days of labor. At this point, we should think of completely mechanized track laying system. That is where NTC, the new track construction machine, comes into the picture. By fully mechanizing labor-intensive processes like the handling and supply of sleepers and rails, the labor requirements in these projects is reduced dramatically. From needing 800 man days per kilometer of track under the manual method, the NTC requires just 20 man days per kilometer of track. ये सारा क्या है एक टीम का काम है जैसे मोल्ड में काम करने वाला अलग है कंक्रीट करने वाला अलग है सब टीम अलग 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 अपने इसमें सबको अपने काम के बारे में पूरा आइडिया होना चाहिए इन ऑर्डर टू कीप द प्रोजेक्ट ऑन स्केड्यूल व्हाइल आल्सो इंश्योरिंग देयर वर्कर्स सेफ्टी द टीम एक्सीडेड द सेफगार्ड्स मेंशनड इन गवर्नमेंट गाइडलाइंस ऑन कोविड in addition to sanitization, social distancing and regular testing, the staff were also provided on-site quarantine facilities and isolation rooms all along the 186 km stretch. Safety is the main concern in this project because this is the challenging project in which we have to follow all the safety standards to prevent the accident. As we are working near to the IR track, we have prepared the safety policy in our site so that the, we can encourage the laborers or operators to work safely at the site to prevent any incident or accident at the site. One of the biggest advantages of the NTC is increased safety of men and materials and the existing track when the NTC is deployed to create a new track alongside. For each kilometer of track laid, 650 tons of weight needs to be handled. Safety is always a concern. The work itself is dangerous and tests human endurance at every turn. The NTC proved to be an asset as the terrain creates plenty of tight spaces on this track where accidents are easy and progress difficult. One of the most interesting challenges the team faced was at Palghar, where the CRZ rules around construction over mangroves demand innovative thinking. Project passes through protected mangroves, which needs to be saved. Therefore, we planned for innovative stilts, which are a type of viaducts, so that we could protect mangroves. In order to make these tilt bridges, the team had to custom build hydraulic rotary rigs and heavy duty piling gantries to deal with the sticky sand conditions. Everything used on this tilt bridge was completely new and custom built, including the load test itself. Yes, certainly this was a challenge for us. We did this with the involvement of a very skilled engineering and uh, skilled designing and uh, it was a good for us. The team here isn't new to doing new things. Some of their work has even set new records. Recently, ILCON made a milestone. We completed road and bridge on National Highway in 20 days time. That was a record. The work on the Walsar ROB needed to be rushed as the Walsar Dharampur Road is one of the busiest passages into Walsar and could not be closed for an extended period. The limited time available meant that 100 days worth of work needed to be done in only 20 days. The approach decided was cut and cover. Irkon decided to cast base slabs and panels near the site as this would offer more agility. These precast segments were the largest ever to be installed in India. It was very little time to see that we had to execute the segmental work of the precast segment. The biggest problem was the size and the size. 
और उसके लिए हम लोगों ने एक स्पेशल ट्रेलर उसका मॉडिफाई करवाया था ट्रेलर की साइज जनरली 2.75 मीटर की होती है बट हमारा बॉक्स का साइज काफी बड़ा था वो 15.8 मीटर बड़ा था उसके लिए हमको स्पेशल फ्रेम्स बना करके ट्रेलर के ऊपर प्लेस करके उसको ले करके साइड पे आना था और उसको अपने जगह पे लगाना था The rains added another layer of complexity to an already challenging site. इंस्टॉलेशन कंप्लीट करने से पहले हमें ये भी सोचना था कि अगर बॉक्स को हमने इंस्टॉल किया और बारिश का सीजन था तो हम वर्टिकली उसको कट नहीं कर सकते थे जहां हमें बॉक्स को प्लेस करना था उसके लिए हम लोगों ने उसमें एक नया मेथड को इंट्रोड्यूस किया जो कि जियो रैप जियो टेक्सटाइल से हम आरी वॉल कंस्ट्रक्ट करते हैं Despite all this, the team was able to finish all the work in time in proud Irkon tradition. And this isn't all. By the time the project is completed, the team will have moved 1.5 crore cubic meters of earthwork. Positioned 10 lakh cubic meters ballast, created 260 minor bridges. and used 6.3 lakh sleepers for 186 kilometers of high quality track this track is capable of reliably carrying freight at design speeds of 100 km an hour compared to the existing 30 km an hour today the dfc project is the next step to a more prosperous tomorrow for every business no matter where they are located Ircon's commitment to quality performance and innovation makes it a strong and stalwart partner in India's march into the future